If you have a new font that you want to use in Scilab and the font type is a true type font, remember that this is a two step process. You need first to install it in Windows and then in Scilab. In Windows 7 and in Windows 8, this process is very simple. Click on an empty space and drag to select the font or the fonts that you need to install. Right click them and click on install. This will install the fonts in Windows. In Windows XP, you need to manually copy the fonts into the font directory. Click on the start button, click on computer, double click the C drive, double click the Windows folder, and double click the fonts folder. Click and hold the mouse to select the fonts click and hold the mouse to drag the fonts into the font directory. This will install the fonts in Windows. Once the fonts are installed in Windows, you now need to install the fonts in Scilab. Click on File, click on Install, and click on Fonts. Since you are installing just the TrueType fonts, you don't need to check the other types. Just have a check mark here. Notice that the look in Windows is grayed out and the reason for that is that all the TrueType fonts are coming from the same location, the Windows folder for fonts. Click on Search Now and then click on Install All to install all the TrueType fonts that you have. Click OK and close the window. Now, the new font should be available from this list of all fonts. And here it is, the new font I just installed.